Wow, once again they change the format. Ay, but this time oh, not bad lah, more informative I must say. Okay, but I'm already very tired of them. Uh, keep changing the format here and there. Already. So I decided to do my own dashboard lah, okay, to show the daily numbers. Okay, I must say first, uh, my numbers are all, all still from MOH one, okay. Ah, only tabulated uh, in a format uh, which I can present a lot more easier. Uh. So, as of 9 October 12 pm, uh, okay, MOH uh, has declared a total of 3,703 new COVID cases, uh, of which uh, 2,868 are in the communities, 832 uh, are in the dorm, and then we have 3 imported cases. We have also uh, 15,606 cases uh, who are on the home recovery plan, okay, recovering at home. 2,875 uh, are in the community care facility. And we have another 360 uh, in the COVID-19 treatment facilities. Then currently, we also have another 1,569 uh, who are warded in the hospital. Uh, of which uh, 302 of them uh, require oxygen and 40 are in the ICU. Sadly, oh, there is also another uh, 11 KO cases are reported. And in the month of October alone, uh, we already have 58 KO cases already. And in the last 28 days, uh, we have a total of 85 KO cases. In this month, uh, okay, the number of vaccinated KO cases uh, is almost uh, catching up with the un uh, unvaccinated KO cases already. So uh, it does seem that, uh, you know, in the KO cases uh, where mainly the uh, people who KO, right, or the cases who KO are the seniors, uh, vaccinated or not, uh, seem to have very little impact. Eh? Of the 11 KO cases, uh, okay, four of them uh, are not vaccinated at all, three are partially vaccinated, and another four uh, are fully vaccinated. Uh. So uh, in conclusion, okay, to date, uh, we have a total of 124,157 infected cases. Uh, okay, and we also have a total of 153 KO cases. At about 1.40pm, uh, 9 October, okay, SCDF uh, was alerted to a fire at Sengang. Uh. When the SCDF arrived, uh, the fire uh, was seen uh, burning from within a residential unit on the 15th floor. Uh. Luckily, uh, at the point of time, uh, no one was at home uh, okay, when the fire occurred. In one of the videos uh, that I'm going to show you guys later, uh, okay, you all can see uh, the neighbors actually broke open the metal gate uh, and tried to see uh, if there's anyone at home at the point of time. Uh. From the video, uh, well, uh, we can already see uh, there's so much smoke already. You know. Anyway, uh, when the SCDF arrived, uh, they proceed to fight the fire uh, and eventually uh, managed to pull out the fire using one water jet. 100 uh, residents uh, self-evacuated themselves, uh, okay. but then uh, one woman uh, who was an uh, occupant on the 15th floor uh, was sent to the hospital uh, as she was overwhelmed uh, by the heavy smoke uh, when she you know, arrived on the lift lobby on the 15th floor just in front of the unit. Uh. Okay, this happened uh, before the SCDF arrived. Uh. Thank you. 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 Thank you.